You're watching ABC4 News. Welcome back. Medical patients around the world depend on plasma donations. ABC4's Saray Chen shows us how plasma donate donors provide people hope and a chance to live healthier lives in this sponsored segment. There is an urgent need for plasma. We need it more than ever, and donations have been impacted by the pandemic. We have Vlasta Hakes with Griffles. And Vlasta, thank you so much for being here. Thank you for having me. Reminder viewers, what is Griffles and what is plasma? Griffles is a global healthcare company, and we operate a network of plasma donor centers throughout Utah under the names of Biomat USA and Talipris Plasma Resources. These centers collect plasma. Plasma is the liquid portion of the blood. It contains proteins and antibodies that help our body's functions. So then Griffles takes this plasma and actually produces a medicine out of it that treats rare and chronic conditions. Tell us more about the urgent need for plasma at this point. Patients continue to need their medicines, whether there's a pandemic or not. And actually, a lot of the patients that depend on plasma medicines are more susceptible to COVID-19. So there's that much more urgency to make sure they continue to get their medications. I know there are people at home right now who are saying, what can I do? How can they donate plasma at Griffles? So first, they can visit uh, grifflesplasma.com, which is our website, has all kinds of information about what it takes to donate plasma. Plasma is an easy thing to do. It's an easy way to give back, take a break in the middle of the day. Thousands of people do it every single day. And they can come visit one of our centers, sit back and relax with us. Well, not only can you feel good about saving lives, but people get paid for donating plasma. Is that right? That's true, and that's because plasma donation takes longer than, let's say, blood donation. We are actually separating the plasma from the red blood cells, keeping the plasma, returning the red blood cells to your body. So that means you actually recover much faster. Plasma recovers in about uh, 48 hours, which means people can give more often. So we encourage donors to come in, visit us up to twice a week with that full day in between, and spend about an hour or so with us at each donation. So that's a way of us giving them a thank you and our appreciation. There might be some concern out there because of the pandemic of not to go to these sites, but tell me what precautions you guys are taking. The, the safety of our donors and employees has been our number one priority since the beginning of the pandemic. So we have implemented all sorts of precautions such as physical distancing where we're seating donors apart. We monitor temperatures, we recover face coverings, we've enhanced all of our cleaning at our centers to really make it a safe environment for our donors and employees. What is Griffles doing to fight COVID-19? So this is also really exciting. Plasma from those who have recovered from COVID-19 contains antibodies that could potentially fight the disease. So Griffles is collecting this plasma, isolating these COVID-19 antibodies and producing a medicine out of it. Right now, patients are receiving this medicine as part of a clinical trial where we hope to see results really soon. So much good that you are doing as well as a company. How are you helping our, our local communities here? Well, all of our centers operate like small businesses in the local community, and we pride ourselves on partnering with local organizations. So donors actually have an opportunity to give back twice. They can give back, obviously, and how it helps save lives, but they can also turn part of their donor compensation commitment fee and, and donate it towards a local charity that the center is partnering with. Remind folks at home again how they can donate. They can uh, visit grifflesplasma.com to learn more. Thank you, Vlasta, so much for your message, and we'll have a link on our website, abc4.com. Thank you.